So hello everyone, my name is Pritam Paul and welcome to another video of the C programming playlist. And in this video, we are going to discuss about the assignment which I have given to you uh, in the last video. If you haven't that video about the escape sequence, then I would really recommend you to watch that video first and after that do watch this. And if you know everything uh, about uh, almost everything about the escape sequences in C, then it's okay, you are fine to continue with this video that's perfectly fine because i am not explaining any conceptual thing here i am just directly calculating it and would be uh, setting up the result of the bus that's it okay i would explaining i won't explain any theory and if you are completely new to this channel then i would uh, recommend you to go through the whole playlist if you want to learn about the c program uh, c programming language and uh, definitely do hit the subscribe button also and press the bell icon so that every video could be reached you through notification so yeah let's start the video so here this is the question what number one here we can see that here it is integer main printf and then uh, aaa backslash b backslash r bbb backslash n ccc backslash b ddd backslash r then x so what will be the output okay so for that we need to uh, calculate it so first of all obviously aaa would be printed out okay and after that the cursor this 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 after all this cursor will be here and due to this backslash b what will happen that uh this cursor will be come back to here because backslash b means just uh get the uh the cursor will get back to the previous position in the current line okay and after that uh this uh r backslash r is there okay and then backslash r means it will be going to back here in the previous position uh, in the first position of the current line then bbb would be printed out so when bbb would be printed out all the a's will be replaced and then b b b has been printed out now the cursor is here and then backslash n that means cursor is here and then c c c so c c c then backslash b again okay then d d d then this c would be replaced okay and then d d d okay and then backslash r backslash r means it will be coming back to here and then x that means here it would be x so this is the output okay now let's check it out this let's run it and check it out okay so here you can see that b b b then x then c d d d so yeah that's correct now let's go to the next problem which is question number two so here uh question number two that uh then hash and hash and dot h okay so a a a the first one is a a a so a a and a would be printed out backslash n here backslash r so here to here which is due to backslash n so as it is already in the uh, first position then backslash r uh, has nothing um, actually meant but uh it, it has been given here to confuse you so just be careful when uh, doing all these things and yeah so uh, now uh, backslash r that means it would be in the first position and then b b b would be printed out so b b n b then here then backslash b means cursor will come back to here and then c would be printed out c and then backslash n that means uh, d d and then uh, backslash r backslash b so from here it would be backslash r and then backslash b that's no point actually so e okay e and then backslash n so cursor would be here after printing e cursor would be here and it would be directly going to the next line it won't shift d by the way okay it won't shift d it the it just moves the cursor to the next line okay so uh, f would be printed out so this would be the output fine let's check it out see a a a b b c e d f so that's it yeah now let's uh, move to the next problem which is question number three okay so here question number three which is uh indian then backslash b then there is a space then backslash n okay so let's just uh, run it first Cursor is here, then backslash b, that means it would be here. Then there is a space. So a space would be printed out, and then obviously backslash n, that means new. Okay, then backslash r, 
Bachelor Charmin, the cursor will come back to here and then Dilli, that means the whole Dilli thing will replace new and then Bachelor Chen, the cursor will be here. So I guess India, Delhi, that should be the uh, output. So yeah, India and then Delhi. So yeah, that's it. Now let's move to the last uh, question in this assignment, which is question number four. Okay. So stdo dot h integer main void then printf hello fri then backslash r then ends okay cool so here hello then space then f ri backslash r so means it will come back to here and then ends so four characters would be replaced end sorry uh, s and then the o okay so this would be the output let's check it out yeah e n d s o then f r i so that's it uh yeah that's it i have explained all the uh, all the problems which i have given in the assignment and uh, if you really like this video if you found this video useful then do hit the subscribe button do hit the like button and let me know in the comment section if any kind of doubt is there and do share this video with your friends guys and do follow the playlist i am saying again and again hit the subscribe button also because it really boosts me up to make all the tutorials for you guys for free of cost so yeah that's it so thank you so much and see you on the next video